Yo, what's going on everybody? It's Roll Easy here. Welcome back to the channel. Guys, I got three easy peasy, lemon squeezy, whatever you want to call them, glitches, man, that you guys can all do. Super easy, man. Let me tell you, two of them are solo. Uh, one of them does require a friend, but barely has to do anything, man. I'm telling you, they're super duper easy. If you guys need a friend, you know where to find them down in the comment section. We got awesome people over here in the easy fam. So make sure you look around and you can find somebody. So judging by the gameplay right here in my intro, you guessed it, we're gonna be showing how to get an invisible car in GTA Online. You know, any any invisible car or any car you wanna make invisible, you can do it in GTA 5 Online, all right? The other two glitches that I'm showing are unlimited barrage missiles. That just came out today. Uh, the Hunter Helicopter, you can get unlimited missiles in the Hunter Helicopter as well as night vision in any Pegasus aircraft vehicle, all right? So without further ado, founders in the description, let's get started. Now, what you want to do, this is for the unlimited barrage missiles in the Hunter Helicopter. This one is completely solo and super easy to do. Obviously, you need a Hunter Helicopter and you need an Ultralight. That is that hand glider airplane that they, uh, you know, brought out with the Hangar DLC. It's like 500 grand, but, you know, if you got one, perfect. All right, so I just want to showcase what we're going to be doing here. Now, as you can see right here, this is the Hunter. The Hunter has barrage missiles in case you guys didn't know. The barrage missiles that shoot like this. So you hold down A or X and it shoots them for like, you know, two seconds or so, like one, two, yeah, about two seconds. It just shoots a few missiles and then it stops. All right, this glitch will allow you to just keep shooting those missiles over and over and over again, no cooldown or anything like that. I'm telling you, it's super legit, super easy, and makes no sense how this actually works. GTA 5 Online is officially broken after seeing this glitch work, all right? So this is what you wanna do. Hop in the ultralight. This is where the glitch starts. So hop in the ultralight, go ahead and press uh, right trigger or R2 to fly out of your hangar. Once you're on the ground right here, uh, just go ahead. You can either back up, back to the hangar, or just turn around like I did and go straight back into your hangar, all right? Just go straight back like that. It should bring you right in, okay? Uh, get past, I fast forwarded through all this long black loading screen. Once you're in there, hop out and go ahead and hop into the hunter, all right? And literally, guys, that's the glitch. It's as simple as that. Hop in the hunter, press right trigger R2 to exit the hangar, and once you're out here, you will have unlimited barrage missiles, and I'm gonna prove it to you right now. So we've uh, just ended up outside of the hangar. Now I'm gonna go ahead and switch over to my barrage missiles by hitting square or X, and here we go. Hold down A, and then boom. Look at that. It just keeps shooting. No cooldown, guys. It's freaking insane. This proves how broken GTA is. This should not make. This does not make any sense. How this works? Just driving an ultralight out of the hangar and back in, and all of a sudden, boom! You got unlimited missiles on the uh, on the hunter. Makes absolutely no sense how this works, man. Uh, so. I'm a terrible pilot, but I just wanted to show you guys the potential of this. You know, you got an enemy right there, and check it out. I blew up his personal vehicle. I didn't get him, and then I crashed into a tree. All right, so not very much health on this thing. I'm not going to lie. Uh, the health isn't so great, but, you know, it's a cool thing. All right, so <laughs> next glitch. This one's completely solo, too. This is how you get night vision in any aircraft you want. All right, Pegasus aircraft, you know, whatever you want, any sort of aircraft, okay? So this is what you're going to do. Go ahead and go to the mask shop and go to the hat section, and you want to go to combat helmets and put on any of these, you know, quad lens uh, helmets, and you want to save it onto an outfit, all right? I already have this quad lens helmet saved onto this outfit, my pumpkin, you know, Halloween outfit. It's already saved for me. Make sure you guys have one saved onto an outfit. Okay, so if you hold down right D-pad, you see he, he puts it up and puts it back down. Make sure those goggles are down. Now, go ahead and jump into an aircraft. I'm jumping into a Hydra. So I'm going to press Y to jump into it. And then I'm going to open up my interaction menu quickly. Go to Style. Go down to Outfits. Hover over this outfit. Just hover over it. Now I'm going to hit A as he's getting in one time. And then again, there you go. And you see it, the hel the uh, quad lens comes off and then it comes back on as he's getting in, okay? So when you see the quad lens helmet come off, just press it again, okay? And go over to helmets in the accessory section and all you gotta do is hit square on PlayStation and X on Xbox. And there you go, you have night vision in your aircraft. It's as simple as that and all you gotta do is go back to helmets and hit X or uh, square on PlayStation and then boom, you are good. I'm even gonna show you guys getting it in a buzzard, all right? So the same thing, hover over, hit it, you know click on it and then boom there you go you do have it glitched on there just like that go over to masks and then down to helmets and then hit x or square and there you go it is active you guys can just fly around and troll people go ahead and turn on ghost organization if you want to be extra sneaky 
Uh, you just hear some clips, you know, of me doing this. There was a bunch of people, you know, fighting at the beach. So I wanted to go ahead and troll some people a little bit. Got a kill on my hands. You know, I'm not terrible. Not terrible at flying and stuff or combat. I just don't really care for it in GCA. But, uh, but yeah, so I was able to get myself a kill there. I do get destroyed right here. This guy was shooting, uh, what was he shooting at me? I missed him right there and there. I can't believe him, man. I was so close. But he was shooting, uh, he had explosive rounds, I believe, on his uh, sniper. So he was just getting me with that, man. Uh, but don't worry, guys. You see that guy, UV, whatever? I I'm going to get him back right here just to show y'all. All right, so I spawned back down at the beach. I'm going to take out my sniper, and I'm going to go ahead and aim at him. He's way the hell down there. One shot. <laughs> so I got him back. All right, I got him back. And there we go. So now the glitch that you guys have probably all been waiting for, the invisible car glitch, all right? You do need a friend for this one. Your friend that wants to make you invisible, he's got to have a cargo bob in his hangar, all right? So it needs to be a personal aircraft. So what you do is you just call up, you know, Pegasus, you get a cargo bob and fly it into your hangar, all right? This is the friend that's helping the other guy go invisible, all right? So if you want to make your friend invisible, you need the cargo bob. The person that's going invisible doesn't need a cargo bob, all right? Your friend needs a cargo bob to help you. So remember, names down in the description, help each other, or sorry, in the uh, comment section, help each other out. So I'm just customizing the color here, and uh, I'm actually going to get the vigilante for my friend invisible, all right? So I told him, go ahead and go all the way up to the mountain, because this cargo bob can't really carry the vigilante very well. So this is what you're going to do. Oh, and you need to be able to sign in as an MC president. Forgot to tell you that. Anyways, so go into a public session to do this. It'll be really fun. Hook on to your friend's vehicle. Uh, since I've hooked onto him just like this, I'm gonna go ahead and sign in as an MC, press Motorcycle Club President, and then hover over Request Motorcycle. All I'm gonna do then is bail out of the Cargo Bob and then spam A, all right? Or that's X on PlayStation. Just spam it, and that's it. The Cargo Bob goes invisible, and then his car goes invisible with it because it was hooked on. That's as easy as it goes, guys. Now I'm gonna show you what it looks like when he does it to me, all right? I'm in, the, I'm in my vehicle, my Tampa, that I wanna make invisible. He's gonna go ahead and pick me up with his cargo bob. I don't know how he didn't hook me on that one. Cargo bob is like broken sometimes too, but he can drag that thing all over the car sometimes, it just doesn't hook on. But anyway, so he should be hooking on to me anytime now, and once he does, he's gonna sign in as a motorcycle club president, all right? So here we go. He's signing in as an MC president. He's hovering over request motorcycle, and he's just gonna go a little bit higher. He asked me right here, should I stay right here? And I said, no, go up a, a better distance. So I said, just go up a bit higher. And once he's ready to go, he's hovering over request motorcycle. He's just gonna bail out of the helicopter, and you see that? Spam A to request motorcycle, and boom. He drops me, and I go completely invisible. Although I can see myself, nobody can actually see you. You're actually completely invisible. You're still on the radar and stuff, but you are completely invisible, all right? So this is how it looks. Pretty dope glitch, guys, I'm not gonna lie. I recommend doing it with the Vigilante, and this is why, guys, it's crazy. So with the Vigilante, you're completely invisible to everybody too, but on your screen, for some reason, you still see the car and everything. You see yourself, it's weird. But check it out, he's in the Vigilante right now. Remember, we did this on the mountain when I got him invisible. All right, and I'm gonna show you crazy clips of what happens when you do this with the vigilante. It's so glitchy It's not even funny. So well, it's actually hilarious, but check it out So you see that he's shooting missiles from his vigilante. So it is indeed right there I'm gonna show you guys launch glitches and under the map glitches that you can do with this All right, so check this out. This is a launch glitch right here I just walked up to him and I just hit X and then you know to get on the uh, you know That'd be square on PlayStation just to climb on it and it launches me all right we have the best uh, launch glitches when you actually try to climb on the back of it. So let him know when you're on the back, and then that's when you want to go ahead and try to climb on top. So check it out. He got out of the uh, car right there, and you know, it's invisible. So he's going to hop right back into it, as you can see right there, and then he goes invisible again. So just like that, he's invisible. And after he does that, if you try to climb on it, look what happens. Climb on the side of it, and look what happens. So I'm going to climb on the side. And then check it out, boom, it just literally launches me down under the map. So it's crazy, yo, the, the Vigilante is super, super glitchy. Under the map glitches, launch glitches, everything, man. Uh, yeah, check this one out, this is more, I got awesome footage. Yeah, you see that? I barely even touched, uh, you know, to climb on him. <laughs> and it just launches me down under the map. Here are two awesome other launch glitches that happen, okay? <laughs> Look at that, like, come on, that is so cool. I haven't done a launch glitch like this in a while. 
all right this is all with the vigilante super glitchy see if you can do it with with other new war stock vehicles you know but uh yeah another launch glitch these are amazing and super fun to do man telling you find a friend if you don't got one uh in the comment section here and you can do all this really fun stuff okay under the map launch glitches everything all right this is a really really cool glitch uh, take advantage of it now. You never know when Rockstar patches these things up, all right? They're like the fun police, okay? So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I enjoyed making it and bringing it to you guys. Uh, my name is Rolizi. Make sure to drop a like if you did enjoy it. Uh, you know, and if you want to support the channel, I really do appreciate it. Uh, you know, slap that subscribe button by pressing that big red button that says subscribe if you're new. And turn on them post notifications for the freshest and most informative dope GTA 5 online content. Peace out, everybody.